Yay! <laughs> Hello, teacher. <laughs> teacher. Hello, can you hear me? Uh, how do you say your name? Uh, Gulan. Gulan? Gulan? Yeah, Gulan. <laughs> nice to see you. Oh, I can see. <laughs> nice to meet you. In my first class with oh, you. Nice to see you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <coughs> okay, I will try to. Uh, um, let me just find something for you. Um, graphics. Oh. Ah, oh, here, here, look. Hey, David, do you hear me? Yeah. Uh, are you, are you a brother, cousin, I don't know, with Juan? Uh, uh, I don't know. You like, I see you the, the same face. <laughs> <laughs> the same face. Yeah, <laughs> it's almost. Oh no, the same last name. <laughs> same face, uh, same surname. I don't know, but the most common surnames. <laughs> he lives in Argentina. <laughs> and you, where are you? I'm from Ecuador. I don't know. Oh. Maybe we are. <laughs> yeah, okay, maybe. Kobe, <laughs> Kobe, man. Uh, where are you from? Jose. I am living in Boston, oh, yeah. but I'm from Salvador. Do you know the dear country in America Central? Uh, Central yeah. America? Yeah. 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 Like Nicaragua, Salvador. Yeah, yeah. Like Three and one. Right, okay. Juan no. Arroyo and David Arroyo. <laughs> let me Okay. Let me share my screen for you. Let me share my screen. Look at this. This is for what we were talking about. You see um Ah, there it is. Can you see my screen? Can you see my screen? Can you see my screen? Yes, did you? Yeah. What is that? What is that? What is on the screen? It's about the, the population, the quantity of habitants. Yeah, population of different countries. Okay, uh, Juan, you're from Argentina, aren't you? Is, this is approximately right? Yeah, yeah, teacher. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, live teacher. in Colombia, this is about right. Is anybody, is anybody, ah, who's from Ecuador? Uh, me. I'm from yeah, is this, a, is this about right, 15 million? Uh, I think that is less, like, Thirteen million. Thirteen. Okay. Well, we use this number now. Um, Oliver, is this about right for Chile? Yes, I guess so. Yeah. Okay. Uh, do we have anybody else from any of the other countries? But that is just so America. You have to add Central of America too, like Nicaragua, Mexico. Mexico's in North America, isn't it? Uh, technically. Costa Rica. But yeah. if you if you add Mexico, just, 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 wait a minute. Wait yeah. a minute. Just just listen to something. De De David, can you hear me? David, yeah. Arroyo. I can. Where are you from? Where are you from? Listen or why? You're white. No, what, Ecuador. What, Ecuador. What? <laughs> sorry. <Are> you sure? <laughs> sorry. <laughs> you are from Ecuador. Yeah, exactly. What 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 language do you speak? 
Spanish. Spanish. <laughs> what is your native language? Yeah, Which Spanish. We Spanish. Okay. Spanish. Isaac, where are you from? Isaac, are you there? Okay. Isaac. Jose. Isaac. Jose, are you there? Yeah, I am. I am from El Salvador, but now I'm living in Boston. But in Salvador, Salvador, Central America. Spanish. So what? Yeah. What Spanish. language do you speak? Spanish. Spanish. Yeah. Juan Arroyo. Yeah, where are so... you? So Juan Arroyo, are you there? Hola, Barry. Yeah, I'm from Argentina. And what is what language do you speak? Spanish. I'm from Chile. I speak Spanish too. Hey. Paula, where are you from? I'm from Brazil. <laughs> so you speak Portuguese? Yes. <laughs> nice. Uh, and I think but that we are Paola. all American guys here. What? So you have Do you one speak Spanish too? Oh, I try to learn it, but um, I, I'm not good in Spanish. Oh, yeah. yeah. But you can see that we are five American people. Four yeah, but that's just a uh, sample of yeah. like five, or five different countries. So yeah, what but when the population of one country in America. is bigger than all the other countries combined, I you have heard to say uh, a lot of voice. About, about countries. And no, you have more countries the, the, the geography is America. not even that much bigger difference. Yeah. I mean, South uh, Brazil is the, I think it's the third of the whole of South America, isn't it? No, let's have a look. Brazil, I think Brazil the is meat. the third of South yes, yes. By the way, teacher. Yeah. What is, what is your native, or oh, what? what is your native language? Mine. Spanish. Spanish? <laughs> no, 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 no. No, no, it's not. <laughs> but, um, because your name is not Spanish. <laughs> My name's not English. <laughs> it's not English, too. So, <laughs> you can't tell just by the name, can you? Um, what am I looking for? Land. We live here. We know what we speak. <laughs> well, you don't know what most of the continent speaks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> <laughs> it's 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 um, oh, South American countries. <laughs> but, I mean, the best way of measuring it is by number of speakers. <laughs> And the largest number of speakers are Portuguese speakers. Like the only reason there's so many Spanish, well, the main reason there's so many Spanish speakers is because of uh, Mexico, isn't it? Because Mexico has such a big population. But if you include Mexico, you have to include South America, um, North America. And if you include North America, then you have loads and loads of English speakers as well. So, um, let me find a um, so, teacher, yeah, okay, tell so your language is, is English, is English, yeah, English, just English or another one? Do you have no, another my, one? My native language is English. Oh, okay. Um, Yeah. Oh, look, here we are. Maybe this is on his back to uh, South America. Um, it's quite hard to find. What's, what's it called? Land. Oh, area. Area. That's pretty easy to work Let's hold up. I think, I think Brazil is a third of South America, isn't it? Uh, 
Are you looking for the area? For the area? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for list of areas, which isn't on Wikipedia, because Wikipedia is you could have changed it. <laughs> oh look, look, um oh, that's the population. Mm. So very good. And uh, Argentina. I took Argentina out. I think it would be the same. Um, South American. It's probably so hard to find. Let's just go on Wikipedia. Countries. Um, ah, there it is. Yeah. Maybe it's not entirely accurate, being as it's on Wikipedia, but it'd be more honest. So, where's the calculated thing on? The. Uh, Argentina. Right. Argentina is 2.76. Does that sound all right? But if you see your country on there, yeah, it's all right, teacher. It's all right. It's, 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 all right. it's more, or like, more or less all right. So we use the kilometers one. So 2.76 plus uh, Bolivia. 1.0, uh, where is it, 9.98, nine, plus Chile, is the number for Chile right, more or less, 756.9. Yes, it's right. Yeah, Colombia is more or less, right, one. Argentina, um, Bolivia, Brazil, okay. Chile, Colombia, Ecuador, and Paraguay speak Spanish too. Yeah, but just because you split them up into different countries, <laughs> it, does, it doesn't mean there's more of them. It's like <laughs> you could pay, you could like, let me see, where's this, like, look, Europe, well, it's Africa, Africa, there's loads of countries in Africa that speak French. Just because they're separate countries, it doesn't mean the language is more important. <laughs> Yeah, but here, no, Brazil, 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 yeah, Brazil, Brazil you could easily split. Yeah, but Brazil, you could easily easily split into loads of different yeah, countries. Yeah, but it's, it's just one country. You can yeah, go. Yeah, that, that's irrelevant. A lot of the re a fact that, that is one country no, is irrelevant. No, go, go, when go, that one it's, country it's, has, but like, if you if you want go to tourist for South America, yeah. it's better for you know Spanish than Portuguese. Because Portuguese right. is going to help you just in one country, and yeah, Spanish but that country you can use it is in, in all every country else. Yeah, but you the can size go of to the country Japan, is, you, is you very important. You can go important. to Bolivia, you can go to Chile, and you and you know if you are going to Brazil and you know Spanish, you can understand Portuguese too. Because in Brazil, no, a lot of people understand, understand the Spanish too. Most people but don't the other, the, I, li other I lived in that, and most people don't understand Spanish very well. What is the, the point of the deal? <laughs> what? Okay, well, can I talk? Can I talk? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Can I talk, guys? Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, Oliver House has a little reason because you know, teacher, uh, Brazil. Okay, it's a one country. If you go to another countries in South in South America. You see, all the countries speak Spanish. If you know Spanish, you can meet people in Spanish. All the people in that country speak Spanish. You go to Mexico, Spanish. Central America, Spanish. You go to USA, okay. Here, the language we know is um, is English. So, but if you come here, somebody will speak English, Spanish. Sorry, Spanish. So. Um, almost the popular 
language in America is uh, Spanish and English. It's, and it's not that. It's, it's Portuguese because there are more Brazilian speakers than the rest of than other Spanish speakers in South America. And yeah, just because it, the it, Spanish speakers are split into different countries, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Just yeah, when they become yeah, independent, they split into different countries. The same could have you, happened with Brazil. You, you, it just you, didn't. You have, you yeah, have that's to right, it. Teacher. You have to, that's right. But to, if the, I mean, it's the, irrelevant. They're different countries. No, like no, if you really travel good. between Brazil, like if it's you go to Fortaleza, or if you go to Sao Paulo, you may as well be in two different countries. They're so different. So I mean, it's not. It's if, 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 sorry, if, sorry, that, teacher. For for example, no, if you if, if you work, the point, then for surely example, we have to learn Chinese because two thousand million people in the world speak Chinese. But no, we are not learning Chinese. We are learning yeah that's... English. <laughs> yeah, but that's only because it's so different, and most Chinese, Chinese people are learning one English. Country. They have a lot of people, but it's we just know one that. country. Yeah, when people learn Chinese. Though. It's the like second most popular language to learn. It's Chinese. Yeah, so, that kind of defeats your argument. When more people are learning Chinese. It's like yeah. they're not not learning it. People that want to do business with China, they use, learn Chinese. I mean, Chinese people are learning English, but it's the second most popular language. Is Mandarin. But yeah, I, but I think that all the people. Me. But it's not gonna help you if you go, if you go to Argentina. If you come to South America, you know Spanish people to Argentina are like the some, the some of the sounds are more like the Portuguese. But the size of Brazil and the number of speakers is. Look, I'm trying to work out the size because the first time I did it was wrong. And you do the math too for the number of people. Well, Brazil have. One hundred ninety million. People. And uh, we just did it. We just did the maps. We found out that there are more speakers. Can I, can I, you can see the you can you can see the population okay. right there next to the Yeah we did it. We did square. it before we okay. did the thing and we saw that Brazil okay. was somebody can hear me? Somebody can hear me? Hello? Yeah. Yeah, can yeah. I have the time to speak something? Go ahead. Okay. Okay, the first language in the world most speaking is uh, China. It's Chinese, Mandarin yeah. Chinese. The second one is Spanish. So the second is English. The third no, is Spanish. No, it's not. And Hindi. I didn't know. I know. The, the the I will show you something, teacher. Okay, look at this. I have uh, just a minute. Come. Just this. The, the third, Hindi and Spanish are the same. Look at it here. Look, look here. Um, look. It's almost the same English and Spanish. Look, can you? Hang on. Hang on. Let me change my screen. What yeah. I'm looking at. Okay, go to the Hangout and see the screen, my screen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's almost the same Chinese. Yeah, but this is Wikipedia, the same isn't it? Have you looked at another resource as well? What's that? You should look in another resource because this is Wikipedia. That's why I'm trying to find a different one. Look, the Hindi and Arabic ones are wrong. Uh, yeah. Hindi, because look, I, I've read. This is I'm really interested in languages. Like mm -hmm. Hindi and English, uh, Hindi and Spanish are the same. Hindi, like the population do you, do you of think? India. Yeah, the population of India is like a billion or something. Not a billion, but because it's really high. And I am Hindi, in Hindi is like the sort of, it's not everybody speaks it, but most people in Hin India have some knowledge of Hindi. There's more. But anyway, look, I've just, again, this is Wikipedia, so it's not exactly accurate. So the population, can you see the calculator? No, come on. I am, I am watching this on Wikipedia. Wikipedia? Just say Wikipedia. Wikipedia. Yeah. Wiki. Wikipedia. And that is their, the source. So I can see here. Yeah, but look at a proper website because Wikipedia is not very really good. Okay. Okay. Anybody we can write on it. That's why I was trying to find other resources. Again, this is come to Wikipedia. Look, this is the um, area of Brazil. Eight thousand eight eight million five hundred and fourteen thousand eight hundred seventy seven kilo 
to the red. This is the population of all the Spanish speaking okay. countries. There's okay. Million. It's like uh, the same. So Brazil is half of South America. And the, yeah. I did it. Okay. Okay. If you go to Spanish, you can see the native speakers are four, four, four seven. No, it's sorry, sorry. Four hundred seven million. Four hundred seven million in two thousand ten. What? Looking at what? Look. Wait. I will. I will show. Um. Here, and you are, right and here. you are looking just for South America. Here. You have to have the other countries in here. Central America. The, here is four. Is yeah, is that? No, read, read what it says. Read what this says. That above it. What region is it? What's up? What is the region? Of, uh, oh, what, what are we talking about? Are we talking about on a well, global scale, or are we talking about in? Um, General. I am talking about general. general. In general. This is yeah. in this is on Wikipedia based to this, isn't it? Yeah. Look, look at something else. The, hang on, let's look at this one. There's a website called like omniblock.com, which is normally better. But anyway, the 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 size of Brazil. Brazil is half of South America. And half of South America speaks Portuguese. That half of South America has a bigger population than the rest of South America. So okay. therefore, Brazil, Portuguese is the more it's the more popular language in South America. The fact that the 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 half the the other half of the country is split into loads of different countries is irrelevant. I mean, they could have easily have split um, Brazil into loads of different countries. They just didn't. Okay. Um, so it's the same, the same, the same size, more or less. Um, I don't know if this has numbers of speakers or not. Uh, is, look, is my screen still still shared? Can you still see my screen? Yeah, I can. So, but right, this is Hindi. This is Hindi. This is, is four hundred eighty-seven million. The source. What? The source. What are you talking about? The, the source. This is yeah. called Om Omniglot dot com. It's a website that's all about languages and writing systems and all that sort of thing. Look, I'll, oh, I'll, I'll okay. put the link for the website. Um, I don't but, know what language is. So. But but you know, if you are in somewhere in the world and you know something from Central America or South America, probably that person speak Spanish. <laughs> yeah. No. No. <laughs> so there there are probably can, speak I, I Portuguese. There are more people that speak Portuguese than that speak Spanish yeah, that are from South but America. But probably so, that person speaks Spanish. <laughs> just, no, they, just don't. they don't. We, we just looked at this. We looked at the area. The area is kind of the same. And the okay. number of speakers, there's more Portuguese. Why, why don't you listen to the You're forcing the thing too much. What? You're forcing the thing too much. The I'm number showing, too much. I'm showing you. Look, the only way you can measure number of speakers don't get is the by point. looking at the number. <laughs> <laughs> you have to understand the number, not you see it. But look, there's no way you can measure numbers without using numbers. You You're talking about numbers of speakers. You have Therefore, to see we look the at different the numbers ways. of speakers. Look, the, way, the other way of looking at it is ignoring the facts and making it up. So you have two options. You can look at the numbers, okay. which are the facts, if, or you can ignore if, the facts yeah. and invent. Yeah, the, the, there's the two options. So I'm trying well, to find Spanish. Yeah, go ahead. Com oh, come, some, come some day to South America speaking Portuguese, and let's see what they have. Yeah, are we? yeah I can go to talk to most of South America using Portuguese. I can travel around half of South America using Portuguese. Teacher, 
Yeah, so, for example, for example, teacher, if if you work in in human resource in a business, mm -hmm. and I and I tell you that you have to contract a manager says for uh, South America, so the second language that you will tell him is Portuguese, no Spanish. Yeah, because Brazil is the big economy as well, the bigger economy. Okay. Brazil, Brazil is like considerably more wealthy than the other countries. So if you're working for an international country, uh, sorry, international company, it's preferable you speak Portuguese. I mean, most places they probably speak Spanish because, I know, right, but I mean, it's, look, I've just shown you the, the facts, right, I'm not, I, this is not something I'm inventing, I've just shown you, we've worked out the, the, the number of speakers in South America, which is less in all the countries combined that speak Spanish than there are in Brazil. We then looked at the area, like the, the land area. The land is area is country? more or less equal. What? You just one country. But that one country um, is as big as the other countries and has a bigger population. Yeah, but the it's not the same. Also, it's just one. One. It's relevant. Just the name. It's the name. When, when look. Um, Juan. Juan. Sorry. Juan, where are you from? Juan. You are yeah. Argentina, right? Yeah, sure, sure. So when you contract somebody to work for you, you the first one language is in what? in Ar in, Ar in, Ar in Argentina. Yeah, Spanish If if he had to contract uh, some people to work in Latin America, no, in Argentina. Oh, okay. In Latin America, where? Which place? Like, um, uh, Daniel, sorry, sorry, I like said Juan. Like Brazil, yeah, like Brazil. The first one, yeah, I think it's Portuguese. Portuguese. And the second one, I think it's English in Brazil. Mm -hmm. it's, it's like, a, I think in where Oliver lives, uh, the first one is Spanish and the second is English, right? Is that right, uh, Oliver? Yes, that's right. Like okay. in every. In my, in yeah, so I, if you're in that country, I could be in Lithuania. If I'm in Lithuania, the first language I want them to speak is Lithuanian. But it, are you going to tell me that means Lithuanian is a more important country, more like more popular language than Russian? There's a, you can't use that example. I mean, if they live in the country, obviously you want them to speak the language. But, Look, another example we can look at to compare, if we look at the, um, the, the product, the gross product, you know what I mean, of the country, yeah. like the, the, the GDP, GDP. Look, if we look at Brazil, it's probably more than the rest of South America. Like, probably Sao mm. Paulo is probably as much as most of South America is. Like, uh, GDP of... South America. So, uh, this, uh, this year, um, yeah. but, but uh, what do you but, think? Uh, but America, uh, but America has three parts. Not just one, has three: North, Center, and South. If we look at and the whole of it, the most important language is English, isn't it? Uh, if we're talking about yeah. South America, the most important language is Portuguese. Um, I'm I'm talking about America is... entirely. Not just South America. Then it's English is more important, isn't it? That English is the international language. Why are you here if English is not the most important language to learn? Right. Um, I don't know if this is going to have the numbers. Ah, look, GDP per capita. We look at the Falkland Islands, which is rather insignificant. No, but the Falkland there. Islands hmm. are just a little piece of people. Yeah, that no. was a joke. I know, it I doesn't know. count. We're not, I'm not including that anyway. We're, we're, not include, we're only looking at the um, Spanish and Portuguese ones. So I haven't bothered including like Guyana, um, French but Guyana. Guyana what, uh, how many people live in Guyana? And no, listen to, listen, listen to what I'm saying. I said I haven't included <laughs> it. Listen. Like, that's your problem. You don't listen. 
Look, they will have less than a million, so that's why I'm not counting them. We're just looking at Brazil, Venezuela, and the Spanish, the other Spanish-speaking countries. Let me find this GDP thing. Teacher, yeah. what do you think about Wikipedia? Do you it's think not, that... It's not very good. Uh, do you think it's never good? You know, it, I, it's right. a guide, isn't it? It's a guide. I don't <laughs> use it. If you, if you want hard facts, don't use it. But it gives you the rough idea. I mean, because the thing is, anybody can anybody can um, edit it, can't they? So it's good and yeah. bad. So, I mean, you can get the rough idea of something, but you don't know if it's exactly right. So that's oh. why I'm trying to find numbers that... I oh, look, look. Look at these numbers. So, um... I can't, hang on, I'll make it bigger. Like, um, can, can you read that, or is it too small still? It's too small. Is it all right now? Yeah, that's better. Okay, so we look at Brazil. That is, can you read that number for me, please, uh, somebody? Surely it's the biggest, but it's, uh, it's the biggest country, too. Yeah, but I'm going to compare it to the whole of South America. Can you read the number? Uh, that will be like... 1,572... Um, 839... Uh, eight millions. Yeah, it was one billion five hundred and seventy-two million. Oh no, sorry, it's more than that. <laughs> I was thinking of that. What? It, one one trillion five hundred and seventy-two billion eight hundred thirty-nine million U.S. dollars. It is. No, we won't read them all. I just wrote them out. <coughs> so, but Paraguay okay, sixteen billion. Hello. Um, thirty-two. Fifty two hundred and twenty seven hundred and sixty nine two forty three nineteen three. Well, so look, if we add all of these other countries, which are all the South American speaking countries, I'm sorry, all the Spanish speaking countries of South America, we get a total of approximately. One trillion two hundred ninety-six billion. If we look at and Brazil, in the one country, but, we get but, one you, but you have to add the uh, Mexico. No, we don't because we're Caraguay, about Salvador, 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 Costa Rica. Yeah. If we add, if we add, Mexico is actually part of North America, isn't it? Um, the continent is, is North America. It's just includes in Central America. No, but we, are, we are is talking it, about South America. We're talking about South America. Mexico. 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 Yeah, uh, uh, Oliver. Does Oliver. Mexico, what about Portugal then? If we say. Um, Mexico is actually part of. Like, um, geographic. Mexico speaks Spanish part? too uh, and is in America. Yeah, Oliver. Then we have, Oliver. If we talk about that, well, then we talk about countries like the USA. And if we add USA into that, it's, it has considerably more land mass and um, like things like GDP is a lot more. So we're talking about South America. So if we talk about South America, well, maybe we of, maybe we go we could see that the most of the countries in America speak Spanish. Yeah, but it's irrelevant. It's just a political thing. Uh, have you have you traveled no, it's, abroad? It's just that it's, just, it's all that I want to say. No, no, no. no, no, no. Uh, have you have you I'm been fine. abroad? Have you traveled to different? Have you I been just, to like Peru just, or I'm, Argentina? I'm just saying that the most of the countries in America speak Spanish. Nothing more. I'm not talking about the people. I'm not talking about the money. I'm just talking about the countries. The most countries in America speak Spanish. Well, um, let me uh, well, um, but we are talking. It's oh, Oliver. Sorry, but the teacher is right because we are talking about South America. I don't know <laughs> why are you talking. You, I am talking about the countries, the number of countries. 
That's the number of right. countries yeah. are. Is there a, uh, is that is that Jose or Jose? Jose. How do you say your name? Uh, Jose. Jose. Uh, which country are you from again? Ecuador. I am from El Salvador. Uh, El Salvador. And when? What countries were El Salvador? Because uh, I don't know. Sorry. The, which which countries you... have a border? El Salvador. El Salvador is a Spanish country. And yeah, yeah, I know. But which countries do you have a border with? Where's your neighbor? Your neighbors. I didn't hear you. I don't hear you. What are what your neighbors? What do you have at your side? You have yeah, border yeah. with what country? Border with what country? You are outside. Of, you are outside of of who? Can Guatemala, you Nicaragua, Honduras. Teacher, can you type? I don't hear you very well. Mm. Uh, Which countries do you have a border with? Do you? Oh, it's uh, um, yeah, it's uh, Honduras. Do you know Honduras? Yeah. Uh, it's uh, Guatemala. Uh -huh. Um, I think it's um, I think it's Nicaragua. Okay, and ha have Thanks. you been there? Have you been to? Have you visited any of these countries? What? Have you visited? Mm -hmm. Have you ever been in one of these countries? Yeah, correct. Yeah. 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 Did, yeah. Did you travel on a bus? Yeah. You went in a bus. On a bus I, or what? Yeah. Wait, wait. Sorry, I have to do something here. Wait. Uh, I think my computer. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and w what was the difference when when you step over the border? Was it like being in a completely different place? Is it just the same? It's um the same, I think. The same, okay. Uh, but you're in different countries. But it's the same. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so where's the difference? Whether all the the Spanish-speaking countries in South America are different countries? Or if they're just one country, like Brazil, is that is there really does it matter? Like when when I go from yes, it's similar, teacher. It may be, yeah, you may accept some expressions. Uh, yeah. it's, it's 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 similar. So like when you live in Argentina, when you go in, uh, when you if you go to Paraguay, is it like being in a completely different? It's not like you're in. A different world, is it? It's more or less the same. So, what I mean is, if it doesn't make much difference, if all the spe Spanish-speaking countries are different, are they? They're different countries, or if they're just one country, like Brazil, it it doesn't have an effect. No, right? it's the, obviously, yeah. if you go, if if I I live in Colombia, if I go to if I go to Buenos Aires, it's going to be completely different. The same thing is that if if it, if I'm in Fortaleza in Brazil, if I go to Sao Paulo, it's like being in a completely different place. So the fact that politically it's a different country is irrelevant. Like right? yeah. they all speak Spanish for the same reason. They they're all part of one empire. It's just when they they were almost like united in a way. Hi. Sorry. <laughs> they were they were like Almost one country at one point anyway, right now. Like Grand Colombia. What the? Oh, sorry. <laughs> the, the fact that politically they're different countries is irrelevant. I mean, they have the same land mass. All the Spanish-speaking countries combined have the same landmass as Brazil. They have a smaller population than Brazil. They have a smaller GDP than Brazil. 
which is what makes a country like is one of the factors which makes it attractive to like foreign countries. Is there, are there stuff you can compare that Brazil would be either equal to the rest of South America or more, more or less? Well, it's more or less equal, right? But there are more, there's more speakers. Surely the way to measure the importance of a language is the number of speakers. If you want to include the area as well, we looked at that, it's the same area. The fact that there's different countries, they have different names. It doesn't matter. If you look at a state, who, who's Brazilian here? Is anybody Brazilian here? No. If you look at the size of a state in Brazil, if you look at Amazonas state, it's as big as probably a South American country is. Right. Look in the. I'm traveling to Rio next Friday, teacher. Are you? <laughs> are you going to speak Spanish to them or Portuguese? This Friday, I'm going to Rio. It's hot there now, isn't it? Yeah, 33, 34 degree. Have you been there before? Yep, yep. I went to Brazil. No, I went to Brazil uh, since four years ago. I, my holidays, I I'm going. Uh, I I visit Brazil ever. Have you just been to? Are you just going to Rio? Or are you going somewhere else as well? Did you visit Brazil, teacher? Yeah, I used to live there. I lived in Sao Paulo. Yeah. For like uh, five and a half months. Sao Paulo. So, yeah, yeah. Can you talk in, por in Portuguese? Mm. You know something about Portuguese or? You know, I used to speak at okay, but because I speak Spanish, it's like mostly here, so I, because they're very similar and I don't practice Portuguese, I've kind of forgotten it. But I'm trying to learn it again to get going to it. No. I found them easy to mix up. Do you speak Portuguese? Yeah, eu, eu falo. No muito, mas eu posso falar. Ah, sim. Yeah. Look, it, look at the states in Brazil. This one. Can you see my mouse? Yes, teacher. Look, this is the boundary. This one is Pará. Yeah. So this is one state. This is Amazonas, which is huge, but it's Amazonas. So Mato Grosso here. And look, if you compare it to Ecuador, Ecuador is like a quarter of the size of Amazonas. If you look at Bolivia, it's the same size as that state. Uh, Uruguay is smaller than Rio Grande do Sul, which is next to it. This is a state here. I am bad. This is smaller than the, this. <laughs> this state, <laughs> the most southern Very state small. in Brazil, is is bigger than Uruguay. So, look, you could easily divide Brazil up into these different countries. And look, if you go if if you go to the like Fortaleza, that's Fortaleza. It's like here, isn't it? Fortaleza is the like a bit is north east anyway. And if you go to Santa Catalina, which is right down here, it's like being in two completely different countries anyway. There's as much variety between here and Fortaleza or for Manaus and Amazonas as there is between Buenos Aires and like Cali and Colombia. It's the same thing. Just just because politically it's one country. I don't think it makes any difference. Teacher, so, 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 yeah. Can I ask you something, teacher? Yeah, so, if I think in in business, economic, and internet, and you imagine, imagine if you are the the owner in Colingo, mm -hmm. and you have to choose other language, uh, you 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 will choose first. Portuguese, that Spanish to learn. 
You know, I think her lingo was set up for actually Brazilians to learn English. Fendi, Fendi. Fendi. How are you, Fendi? Fendi, can you hear us? <laughs> oh yeah, that is Fendi. Fendi. <laughs> Fendi, can you hear me? Hey. Oh yeah. The Fendi, yeah. what, what is the second most popular language to learn after English? In your country. I, I no, in the world. In the world, Chinese. See, Mandarin Chinese. <laughs> and <laughs> the, the third one is Spanish. Yeah, the third one. Yeah, but the third one is Spanish. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey. Awesome. Are you nice. working, Hua? Hua? Hoachi? Are you working? Hoachi? Hua? What? I can't, I can't hear you. Do you have to, you, you, do you see the bottom, the bottom uh, red, the micro? Do you have to click on it? I don't know what's going on. Not your head if you can listen to us. <laughs> she looks like in the office. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what is the topic today? Um. <laughs> Hello. Somebody talking to me. Who's got the stuff on the right? It's on my music. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello, everybody. Hello. Yeah. Are you working for? Yeah, now I am working for the Daikin company. Do you know Daikin? The aircon? No. What? What is it? Can you write it? Aircon. Aircon. My, uh, aircon. Right? my yeah, aircon. Yeah, my, my air company conditioning. business is yeah, aircon, air conditioning. Daikin. Oh. Daikin. Uh, Japanese. Uh, uh, the Japanese product of Japanese. Where is it? Daikin, I know Daikin. It's Japanese mm -hmm. company. Yeah, it's Japanese. Japanese company. Yes. What is it, Hoa? Are you Japanese? Yes, Japanese. Japanese. Ah. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I'm very glad to meet you. Uh, sorry, in the first time I joined the uh, this class, so maybe I I'm shy and <laughs> um. I I am not confident to work to to talk with you, so I think uh, I try to practice in this in the every day. I, I hope my English is um, improved in the future. That's all. <laughs> uh, sorry, this uh, today this not the top list. What's the top list? Uh, we we didn't do the class today. Because we were talking about which is the most important language in South America, whether it's Spanish or Portuguese. What? We were talking about what is the most important language in South uh, in America. In, in South America. In South America. And. Oh, sorry. What, 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 what language do you think is most important in South America? Sorry, sorry. Yeah, tell me again. I didn't. Sorry. What language do you think is most important in South America? Wait. I hear double. I don't know why. Hello. 
Oh my god, no. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Hey, teacher. Yeah. Are you calling me? No? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I was saying. Okay. Which language do you speak? Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> okay. okay. Sorry. Uh, now I have a uh, lunch charm, so uh, I want to say goodbye to you, and I hope I meet you again. In um, yesterday, um, 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 tomorrow. Tomorrow. Um, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> goodbye. Uh, Bye. 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 Just leave it open. <laughs> Is she still there? I reckon she doesn't know. She's doing it. It's very nice. Okay. Yeah. Teacher, you can decide. Is it good? Got it? Yeah, yeah, I said, uh, ho sorry, wh which language yeah. do you think is the most important in South America? It's Spanish. You still think it's Spanish even after all of this? What's that? You still think it's Spanish even after all this information? Um, I can't understand. You, you still, you still think it's Spanish? Is the is the most language in South America? Yeah, it's not. It's not the most popular. Uh, I think. I think, but. <laughs> I don't really know. Maybe it's, we it's are not, wrong. No, it's, it's not the. I just showed you. It's not the most popular. That I, that are most speakers of Portuguese in South America than there are Spanish. There's more. It has the same like land area. Like the, the the land area of Brazil is more or less the same as all the other countries in South America. Yeah, the, yeah. The, the economy of Brazil is bigger than the whole of the rest of South America by like three hundred billion dollars bigger. Whoa. Is it yeah. bigger? Look, look. Probably the population the, the, the GDP of actually look, the population of Sao Paulo is bigger than most South American countries. Like Colombia and um, Argentina have like 45 million or something. Oh. And after that, like Ecuador is smaller than Sao Paulo. Like the, the, the population is smaller. The population of, I can't remember. Like we do simply. Um, populations. Like population of Chile is smaller than Sao Paulo's state. The population of Bolivia is smaller than Sao Paulo's state. The population of Ecuador is smaller than Sao Paulo's state. Um, what else? <laughs> yeah. The population of Uruguay is like only Peru, Venezuela. Oh no, not Venezuela. Peru, um, Colombia, and Argentina have a bigger population than Sao Paulo state. This is just one state in Brazil. This 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 state of has like most of the GDP of South of Brazil as well. I can't remember. Let me find out what the what's the GDP of Sao Paulo the state. Just one state in Brazil. Okay. GDP of GDP of Sao Paulo. GDP of Sao Paulo. Um, is my screen share on or not? Let me put my screen share back on. Um, can you see my screen? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Look. Yeah. Look. The the population of Sao Paulo State is forty one million people. The population of um, 
Argentina. For the two million. Yeah, it's for it's forty two million. So this is just one state in Brazil, has nearly as many people as the biggest Spanish speaking country in South America. The uh, Sao Paulo? I don't know if it, yeah, Sao Paulo State. Sao Paulo in state. Brazil. Here. This is it. Um this is it. Here. In the southeast of of Brazil. It's like the, the second biggest city in um the Americas. Um I can't find the GDP. But I to that we'll just use the we'll just use the Wikipedia there, which may not be that accurate but it'll give you an idea. So let me find that this one state is responsible for thirty three percent of Brazilian GDP. So that means it is a lot of money. GDP is in the year twenty ten, which obviously quite a while ago, the GDP was six hundred and fourteen billion. Six hundred and fifteen billion. If we go back to this list that we had of the GDPs, six hundred and fifteen billion. That puts it at double Argentina's um, GDP. So there's one state in Brazil is twice as much as the richest Spanish speaking country in South America. So Like but Portuguese is the more important language in South America. 